morning everybody welcome back to my channel or if you're new here welcome to my channel my name is Kat and I'm a flight attendant with a major US airline okay so you guys today is day three that we are back so it is April 3rd I should have been able to do the math on that one <laughs> flight attendants can do two different kinds of on-call standby shifts you can do airport standby and you can do at home standby so today we are on at home standby i'm on wrap b so there's wrap a wrap b wrap c and wrap d so wrap b goes from 6 a.m till 6 p.m at my base which is dallas fort worth i am good for four days so my bags are still packed from yesterday, being on standby. For the most part, everything's still in there except for what I need to get ready. But I think I was number eight for a four day when I looked last night. Ah, oh, that first sip of coffee in the morning is so good. Okay, you guys, so I figure right now is the perfect opportunity to tell you about today's sponsor who has never meant more to me than it does today, right now, and basically for the rest of my life. So today's video is being sponsored by GlassesUSA.com. So if you're not aware, I was always wearing blue light blocking lenses to protect my eyes because I work on social media. So I'm constantly working on my laptop, on my phone. I love to watch TV in the background. So I always wanted to protect my eyes. Well, that has changed. I am officially a prescription glass wearer. So I have an astigmatism in my right eye. So basically from now on, I will be wearing glasses. I wear them when I'm reading, when I'm working, when I'm watching TV, when I'm night driving, and they are also blue light blocking. So I have a combination duo up here to help me out. Glasses can be so expensive, but they do not have to be thanks to glassesusa.com. Glassesusa.com cuts out the middle man, and this allows them to offer up to 70% off retail prices on prescription eyeglasses, blue light blocking glasses, sunglasses, you name it, they have it. So you can get a complete pair of eyeglasses and sunglasses starting at only $30 and free prescription lenses are included with every frame. And you can add almost any type of prescription to almost any pair of frames, including sunglasses, which I now have. <laughs> And GlassesUSA.com offers over 6,000 styles of eyewear and sunglasses. So they have in-house brands and designer brands in so many different styles and colors. So anything that you are looking for, I'm sure you can find on their online site. And shopping online at GlassesUSA.com offers you a risk-free shopping experience. They offer free shipping and returns and 100% money back guarantee and a full refund within the first 14 days of your glasses being delivered, no questions asked, as well as a 365-day product warranty but you probably won't be needing that because glassesusa.com also offers you a virtual mirror so this allows you to upload a photo of yourself and try on any pair of frames and see exactly what they are going to look like on your face so to use the virtual mirror you just click try online and then go ahead and upload any photo that you would like next you can move the red crosses on top of your eyes you want to make sure to line it up with your pupil so that way the glasses will line up perfectly on your face then go ahead and click try on glasses. There you can see one pair or as many pairs as you would like on your face, exactly what they're gonna look like. I am once again so proud to be sponsored by GlassesUSA.com. They do a fabulous job in every single time. I am so satisfied and happy with their products, especially now that I need them. <laughs> now with that being said, let's jump back into today's video. My phone stays on loud on the days that I'm on at-home reserve because once they call you, you have a 15 minute period to either answer or call them back. And that includes the parts that you gotta get through the phone tree. So you always want to be by your cell phone on days that you are on reserve and have that baby turn volume up all the way. So because it's only 9.30 and because I'm on the second wrap, there's a decent chance that I've got pretty much the morning to myself before I get any movement to me unless it's just an extremely busy day. So with that being said, I'm going to drink my coffee, hang out with the pepperonis, and go to the gym and get kind of like my daily stuff really focused on getting it done in the morning. So that way in the afternoon, if they call me, I have two hours to get to the airport. And yeah. Hi, baby bandy. Hi, buddy. How's your morning? Where's Mama? Hi, Mama. Hi, baby. You and your housey. I had a feeling you'd come back and save me from all those lonely nights and heartbreaks. And I feel as so I just checked the call out list and it looks like there's still quite a few people available on wrap A for three and four days. There's a handful ready for two days. Um, so there's not really a lot of movement on wrap B right now, which is exactly 
Bye babies, which is exactly what I ended up saying. So I'm still, uh, I think now I'm number seven for a four day because somebody got a standby. So right now we're looking pretty good to be able to go to the gym and come back and have plenty of time and not have to stress out about it. Um, I also looked at open time to see if there were any trips available that they are assigning out. Right now there are no trips in there, but they come throughout the day. So you just have to be continuously checking it if you want anxiety. If you don't, you just kind of let things <laughs> fall where they may but for me I need organization and structure and I need an idea of if I'm gonna fly so I periodically start checking that to make sure I'm seeing where my number is going what trips are coming you can bid aggressive on trips meaning that if I see something that I really want, I can try to go aggressive for the trip and say, hey, 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 I really want that trip. Depending on kind of how things work out or if anybody else went aggressive that's more senior than you, depends on if you get it. I have a standing bid in there right now for international. <laughs> very, very, very unlikely to get uh, international, but I do have a standing bid in there for the day to get international if it does come up. Also, line holders can do something called riding UBL where they have bids in there as well and then they trump any reserves so i'm sure there's line holders out there that have bids for international so i'm i'm fairly positive i'm not getting international today but just kind of wanted to tell you you can do stuff like that so we'll just be hanging out until we go to the gym that was your day and i think i'm gonna play with this love ball now <laughs> Also, this came to me yesterday at the door, which I'm so excited about. So this is my three year suitcase. For us, we get a new suitcase every three years. If you have like some wear and tear on your other suitcase, you can request one. So my zipper actually broke when I was non-revving, like my main zipper. So I finally applied for my three year suitcase. So this should be my new work suitcase. You don't know how excited I am to open that later on. It's like, oh my God, I've, I've actually hit three years with this company. And this is gonna be my fifth year, so I've done four. So this will be my fifth year flying all together, which is wild. Good morning. I look amazing right now. You're stunning, radiance, beauty, elegance. So we just got back from the gym. Chip actually has an appointment he has to go to for his truck very, very quickly. So we just have to make something that is quick and easy right now. So we're gonna do a version of chicken and waffles that's just gonna be fast. So I bought these chicken skewers at Costco, but if you've ever had Zoe's chicken, this is exactly what it reminds me of. It's super good, very convenient. It comes in like two packs. So I opened it yesterday. So I'm gonna go ahead and warm some of the chicken up and we're gonna throw it on top of some thick and fluffy Eggo waffles. And then we also have um, the spicy maple syrup and a sugar-free maple syrup. I haven't tried this yet. Chip says it's really good. So I'll try this, but I'm probably actually just gonna end up doing sugar-free syrup on mine. And yeah, let's get to microwaving. <laughs> Okay, so I'm tracking one waffle. We only have three left and Chip is having two. So I'm just gonna have one, three of the chicken skewers, a kiwi, and I did a serving of maple syrup. I really did not need to track this. I'm also gonna have a handful of strawberries. Not gonna track those either because they're just not very calorically dense. So I'm not worried about it. But I'm gonna end up with this meal, 38 carbs, 14 fat, and 40 grams of protein. So 435 calories. So here's my waffle and the chicken skewers. Then I have some strawberries and a kiwi with syrup on top. So I have been really, really working on getting some new content made for Cat Eye Cosmetics over for the Instagram page. So if you're not following me, go follow me there, shameless little plug. But I am waiting on these stickers for the lipsticks. They're supposed to come in next week so I can relabel those. If you don't follow me on Instagram, then you probably have no idea that I had a big mishap with a lot of labeling issues that I'm gonna have to go through and fix. So I had to order new labeling stickers. But besides that, I also just went back online and checked. There are currently no trips right now open for today. And then I went ahead and bid for tomorrow. So those are all due by three. So you want to put in all your bids for the next day by three o'clock. If you're on a trip or something, you can do a standing bid. So it just bids for you. Generally between like four and five, uh, it's announced like whatever you got. So I'm sure we'll find out in the next couple hours what's going on. But now <laughs> I'm exhausted. Uh, let's go get in the shower. <laughs> so I'm all showered. I'm gonna go ahead and eat one of these. It's like a Greek yogurt ice cream. This is the chocolate chip. 
cookie dough flavor. It's 2.20 right now, so I'm still kind of just waiting to be called. Wrap A finished, so we're up. It's Wrap B's turn, we're front and, <laughs> we're front and center. So now I just have to see what's available, what's gonna pop up. Yeah, I'm getting paid to to eat ice cream at home. I'm probably actually gonna go to the nail salon as well with Allie in a bit, as long as I stay kind of underneath the radar and there's not a lot of trips that are flying around, then I'm probably gonna head over there with her. So it's kind of crazy that I get, I get paid to be on call and do this, like. <laughs> so I've just been kind of putting everything together to do the first edit, but while I'm sitting here, I ended up getting a text message that said, this is my courtesy message to let me know that tomorrow I am on wrap A. So I'm gonna have to wait just a minute and then they'll come out with the list so I can see what number I am available for a three day on the list. So when you're on wrap A, there is a very high chance that you are going to get used because you get used first, essentially. They use wrap D from the night before to go into the early morning. So occasionally they'll pull a few of them, but it really starts the day off with wrap A. So there's a high chance I'm actually going to end up working, but I guess we're gonna have to wait and see. We'll see what number I am on the list because when you check the number you are on the list, that also gives you a better idea to see like how quickly you're gonna be called. Are they gonna be calling you at 3 a.m.? Are they gonna be calling you at 10? You know, it really kind of gives you an idea. It's not always the most accurate. Sometimes like you're very low on the list and you blink and somehow you have made it to the top, but it does kind of help us out a bit. So when you're on reserve at home to kind of figure out, you know, your time schedule of like what you can do, how far you can go, what you need to have done ahead of time, that sort of stuff. Hi babies. <laughs> So I checked the list and I am number 11 for a three day tomorrow on wrap A. So there is a very, 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 very high chance that I'm going to get used tomorrow. So I'm actually kind of excited about that. Right now it is 423. I get off officially from my standby at six o'clock. There are no trips currently open. So I think it's safe to say that I'll be all right going to the nail salon with Allie right now. Lady, took me down to where I've been lately. Yeah, her love can make a person hazy Praying she won't break me down So right now it's actually 6.38. I did not get used today, but because I'm actually number 11, which is fairly high for a three day to be used. Tonight, I'm gonna end up prepping some meals to take with me in case, worst case, me and Chip can just microwave them tomorrow. Right now though, I did end up making this big delicious salad. I actually make this salad quite often. So this is just some kind of romaine mix. I did cherry tomatoes, red onion, cucumber, avocado. Sometimes I don't do avocado and jalapeno and then I go ahead and use this ranch dressing and I also have um, two of those chicken skewers from earlier as well so it's a pretty fair sized bowl so I'm gonna go ahead and snack on this so hopefully this is gonna fill me up so that way I can actually do dinner with Chip tonight because he said he's gonna have a late night and I don't want him to eat by himself oh and also these little crispies because I forgot to mention it they're these things I like to switch it up between these or um, croutons or just any kind of salad topping just for a little bit of extra crunch look who showed up <laughs> So I have been working a lot on getting the video edited and again on some Instagram stuff, just getting some stuff taken care of. But now Mr. Chipster is back at home. So I'm gonna go ahead and get cooking dinner. Some of what I'm cooking is also gonna be for tomorrow if I get you. So I'll just prep it in like one big batch. Are you gonna help mama cook too? Or are you just gonna watch, huh? Are you gonna help mama? That seems like a no to me. Oh, so this is the chicken. Wow, rude. Chippy, this is, <laughs> this is the chicken that I got from Costco. So I got two things of it, obviously. It comes with like two large chicken breasts in there. So I'm gonna prep two for us to eat tonight and then two to take tomorrow. It's already 10.30 right now and that salad actually really tied me over for some reason. So I'm, I'm just gonna eat the chicken breast by itself because it has a grain, it has a vegetable and honestly it's just good. So I'm gonna eat this by itself. I think Chip is making some street corn alongside his, but I'm probably also gonna meal prep some of the street corn with the leftover chicken skewers. So then everything's pretty much just good to go in case they do call me. <laughs> 
So I didn't realize that this chicken is actually microwavable. So I'm gonna pop this in the microwave, but the other chickens for meal prepping, I can just put into containers. So I actually don't need to heat those up. So that's super, super convenient. And we picked this up from Costco as well. This is what Ali recommended. So I figured this will go well with the chicken skewers. And this is also microwavable. So that also makes that very, very convenient to take and prep. So it looks like my meal plan pretty much just did itself. Okay, so now that that basically just took care of itself, perfect. But with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and eat dinner and call it a night. If you did enjoy this video, go ahead and give it a big old thumbs up, press the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.